Okay, so what is once again up everybody on YouTube? It is Monday and we are back again right here on Two Bros Gaming HD. And as you probably can see up in the top left corner, we got the version 1.2.0.1 of Farming Simulator 19 right here on Two Bros Gaming HD. That means we got a new update for the game of Farming Simulator 2019, which is online now for ps4 and xbox one and i think it is super super cool to see these kind of things on the console so that is the new patch that is the new update we got it here the only thing you gotta do is that you have to kind of click the the option button on your game like the game menu and you gotta search for an update and then it just says there is an update or sometimes it just automatically actually update but you have to do that and actually update the game it takes like five minutes with normal kind of speed internet like you know like standard internet i think five minutes that's not long of your your entire life but right here we're in the game and there is some changes with this game that we really want to go ahead and show you guys right here and those are actually going to change the game as we know it but first of all i just want to check the mod section right here yeah we don't have any new mods, I can see. I just thought that the Maplefield Gold Coast Valley sign right here, I haven't seen that before, maybe I have, but I just thought that the Gold Coast Valley map was actually in the game for some reason, but it isn't. <laughs> so that's pretty sad. But uh, I still I still do believe that it's pretty good with this update right here. It just means that they're actually thinking of us. And it is also giving out there on the market uh, as we was actually promised. So. Before we get going with this, I want you guys to smash the thumbs up if you haven't already done that. Let's go ahead and see if we can get 100 likes for this new update on the PS4 and Xbox One. Because it is going to do a lot of changes to the game. This new update right here also comes with the new landscaping feature. Which means you can basically landscape your whole map on the console. Which has never been seen before. I showed you guys that a little bit on the PC. And it is completely the same thing to do. <laughs> Uh, just without a mouse but you're using the controller we're going to get into career mode right here let's go ahead and do that and we're going to change or kind of take the save game or do it i'm i think i'm going to start out with the raven port map right here just to show you guys what this is all about this is my go-to map right here where i kind of show you guys new things and new updates and stuff like that so why not go ahead and take that just for just in case if we should actually go ahead and destroy something uh, with the texture and stuff like that I don't want to destroy the, the map that I'm actually playing in actually so yeah we got it right here and we're waiting for it to actually kind of upload or kind of load so while we are waiting for that you can you have plenty of time to go down and click the red button under this video to actually subscribe to the channel like the other 23,330 people already has Join the movement and join the peeps. That would be pretty cool. And also, you have plenty of time right now to go ahead and hit the thumbs up if you didn't do it like two minutes ago. So hit the thumbs up. That would be really, really cool. And um, yeah, thanks to the family and thanks to Two Rose Gaming HD family for actually supporting the channel right here. It is really cool to see that there is so many people. So guys, we are also ready to get into the game right here, which we're going to go ahead and do right now. And... This is the map. This is the freaking map. We have nothing to actually show you guys right here. But what you have to do right now is to click on the touchpad. And just click on that right now. Now we have the menu up in the top middle of the screen right now. You have this, which is the brands. You have this, which is the wiggles. You have this, which is the tools. You have this, which is the objects. You have this, which is the playables. And you have this, which is the new landscaping feature in the game of Farm Simulator 2019. And this feature right here is going to change the game as we know it, as I just said earlier in the video. You're going to click the cross right here. And then you can see you have different kind of options. You have the option of sculpting and you have the option of painting. So that is what we do have right here as an option. You don't own this land. I don't own any, I actually don't own anything in this, uh, in this map right here. So that sucks a little bit. So why not go ahead and, oh, I own field number 12. That's pretty cool. But why not go ahead and just buy something? We're gonna click the L3. We're gonna buy this land right here. We're gonna take this. We're gonna click the, the, this right here. And we're gonna click this right here, buy. So now we bought those. That's pretty cool. 
Then we're gonna get into the touchpad. No, we're gonna get into the option because I want the help menu to be on. I need that to actually go ahead and do this. Some of you guys, if you're hardcore, you can go ahead and do it without the help menu, but I need the controls to actually go ahead and see how do I control this and how should we actually go ahead and react right here. So I'm up at my fields right now, which is right here. I'm gonna zoom out. You can see right here, these are the fields that I do have right now. So you can go ahead and do anything that you want with this. You can click the cross to race like this, as you saw in my previously video. You can click the circle to, no, that's going back. You can click the, the pivot one and then you just lower the, the ground. Then you can click the triangle to smoothen out the area so that it gets nice and smooth. You can also check the, the R1 to actually flatten. Then you just put it down in the ground actually, which seems a little bit strange. And you can take the L3 to change the landscaping mode or R3 to change modification shape. And you can rotate the camera and you can move. You have the zoom option right here. So if I want to raise this right here, we should probably go ahead and do that. And you can also change like the strength of the uh, brush. I don't know how you actually take change the brush size, but you can please let me know if you want to. You can see right here, I just put out the strength to be like the sickest strength in the world. And this is like, this is as high as you can actually get. And uh, that's pretty freaking high, I think. So I need a car because I need to get up there. I need to see that. I'm just going to take the Fiat 1300 DT. Yeah, because we got to run. Yeah, you can see right there, we got the tower. So that is also some options that you get with the new kind landscaping feature. You can actually go ahead and make mountains if you want to. And you also seen in my previous video that I kind of went up there with the car, which is pretty sick if you ask me. Like, you can, I can actually drive a car up on the mountain. And I was just like, wow, that's awesome. And you guys was probably like, this is not real life. Go get a life. <laughs> I don't think so, but right here we have this. You can see how high it is. It's just sick. I don't even know why they make that option available, but it's just cool to get that up here. I think it's just sick. It's, this is basically, it looks like a three actually. Uh, if I go in here again, I can check the sculpting. I can start landscaping and I can kind of, I can go ahead and smoothen this. So that we get like, like nice and, uh, oh, that was not what I wanted. But then I smoothed the side right there. And that means you can basically get up here. I think maybe I can drive up there. This has four wheel drive and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and see if we can get up there. No. So the ground is like too smooth, <laughs> not too smooth, but it's too, what can you say? Like, oh. Yeah, it's just not as we want it. But you can actually go ahead and raise this, you can see right here. And of course you can change the brush strength to something a little bit less hard than this. It's, this is just bungling, like you can see right here. It just makes towers, like for real. This is bungers, you can see that. If you can't see that, that's just your problem I think. But. You should be able to see that right here. It's just the update is here for the game and you can do it whatever you want to do with. I think it, at least it's pretty cool to, to see these updates in the game, of course. Oh, where's the tractor? Oh, jeez, you can see right there. The tractor is just built it in right here. Oh my God. I'm taking the route. <laughs> oh, shit. This is just sick. Oh, what the heck is happening? So this can actually be like also misused, but I would definitely go ahead and change. Oh, Jesus. I would definitely go ahead and use it for my, uh, you can see right there, this is sick. So you can actually kind of like lower the, the ground or 
higher the ground. You can see right there, this is sick. You can make your own. Have you seen Elysium, like the one with Matt Damon? You could basically go ahead and make a whole Elysium up there and just make your own world. That's sick. So yeah, that is the update for Farm in 2019 right here. You can go ahead and use it what you want. I'm gonna go ahead and do some more stuff on this, like show you guys what you can do and stuff like that later on in some other videos. So please go ahead and make sure to subscribe to this channel if you wanna see more. And of course, hit the thumbs up if you haven't done that yet. Just make sure to subscribe to the channel also. We're gonna see you guys in the next one. Throw a comment down under what you think about the update. Have you downloaded it yet? What are you actually doing with it and stuff like that? We're gonna see you guys in the next one, as always. This is Two Bros Gaming HD. We're coming straight at you with yet again another video this Monday. But now, we're gonna turn off for this one. We're gonna see you guys later. Bye guys, bye.